complete and absolute disaster, darling. <laughs> Oh, you've kicked like over my. Uh, it is just water. Uh, Craig Rubble Horwood, everyone. Oh. Yeah. I know. I'm wrecking, I'm wrecking the scenery. I know. Although I do like a bit of glitter in my life. I know, darling. but that's really cheap. Please don't take that with you. Uh, I won't. you uh, we love Blackpool, and I think you've been 7,000 times. We've counted. Oh, is really? It, is it still special? Of course it is. I mean, what I love is the ballroom itself, and it's a sprung floor, so you see the whole thing moving. It's just wonderful to dance on and that the atmosphere Zoe is absolutely brilliant it's and it's like second to none it's, yeah. it's, and it's such a lovely change from the studio and it's halfway point and it's where everyone wants to get to now we've just got Ed Balls to deal with <laughs> oh stop he's just coming saying. down from the ceiling with a piano it's going to be incredible <laughs> um do you have any favourite Blackpool Tower moments? I mean, there have been some amazing... Simon Webb's Argentine Tango is Oh, there's amazing, been some fantastic personally... ones. Well, for me personally, I loved being thrown onto a guitar and then having to enter... <laughs> and there only... you are on said <laughs> Yes. <laughs> no, <clears throat> well, I was only told that five minutes before. <laughs> only because, yeah, it was very really? odd. Someone else was meant to do it, but they... Well, I'm always the guinea pig in these moments. You so. love it! And I love being and live, you... darling. I couldn't reverse it. I did it. I came down and it Life exploded for it me. It really did. That was up there with Anne Widdicombe for me. Um, <laughs> the other exciting thing about Blackpool is the after parties are something of legend. Well, yes, I have um, been known to crawl along gutters there, darling, outside the hotel. <laughs> I think there have been paparazzi shots as well. <laughs> they tend to go on and on. And on. And, and on. on. Yeah. Which judge will be the last standing, do you think, this but, year? Well, it, well, it's generally me, but <laughs> I'm actually this year going back, darling, because I've got work on oh, Sundays. Oh, I, no. do have, I do have a day job, you darling. Do I don't just hold paddles from one to I four. I know, exactly. <laughs> Darcy last year, I think, was the last one up. Um, now, is there a danger of you being swept away by the magic of the Tower Ballroom and getting out your ten paddle this weekend, Craig? Well, that remains to be seen, and it depends what happens. They are under a lot of stress, a lot of pressure. It's a lot bigger space to dance in there's everything's bigger you know the audience and just the atmosphere so that makes them a little bit more nervous so i don't know i mean i'm not planning to okay <laughs> but last year you did something, it. yeah something might just i know take Can my you imagine fancy how excited it'll be the whole place will come down it'll be hysterical <laughs> tonight it's not just blackpool this weekend tonight very important night children in need pudsey is here Yay! Oh, Pudsey! <laughs> Yes. Tonight. What can we expect, Craig? Well, you can expect some really uh, good dancing and some really bad oh, dancing. Good. Is there a but I, yes, I had to be. Oh. I had to be tone myself down. You're normally quite sweet on children in need. Uh, yes. No. Well, it was a little bit difficult this year, but you will see. You will Our see. Olympians. No, but it's great. I mean, they put themselves up there. They have literally a couple of days to rehearse, and I think it's really yeah. brave of them. And it's for a fantastic, it fantastic really calls. So. I know. Good. And you can see a little trailer for that Strictly in Need Strictly special coming up later. But right now, we have some questions that have been sent in for you by some. Strictly Superfans, in a brand new segment, we're calling... Ask Craig! Oh, um, oh my goodness, that's oh, that no. lens lens, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> Ask Craig. This is almost a promotion. Here we go. Are you ready for this? Our first a lovely person to ask a question. Let's have a look. Who is this? <laughs> oh, we can't hear him. Just wondering, Craig, why didn't give AJ and Claudia a 10 in their Vini's Walls? I thought it was amazing. Love you. Ah. Ah. Thank you, AJ. Uh -huh. um, why didn't you give him a ten? Because it wasn't worth it. OK, all right, that's better. Well, there we go. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. No, it wasn't perfect. Wasn't a little perfect. bit of gapping, all of that stuff. Yeah. Gosh, I shouldn't know. have asked. I shouldn't have asked. I mean, I've, it's got to be fantastic. For me to give a ten, I want to be transported, darling, to another place. And OK. That's not on this earth, you know? And that's when suddenly... Whoosh! I get overwhelmed with excitement and the tingles shiver down my spine 
and my hair oh, stands quite enough erect on it. Um, and then I find it somewhere. Natalie from Sydney has a question for you. Oh. Craig, every week I'm doing everything in my power to get Greg as good as you want him. Can you please give me one piece of advice that I can tell him that may get us to the final? Sure. Surgery. <laughs> Molded oh, or something. So cruel. And have Let's see who part of his bottom chopped touch. off. That might help. Yeah. We have another one for you. Here we go. This is Ore. Hi, Craig. It's Ore from Manchester. Um, now, you criticised Ore in Orange Alan's Salsa for not having too much figure of eight, and I know full well that his mum also thinks he hasn't got a good figure of eight. So, would you mind showing him and his mum how a figure of eight really should look? Yeah, come on. Figure of eight. Figure of eight. Figure of eight. Figure of eight. Not bad. I give him a oh. second. I think we have time for one more question for Craig. No more questions. I don't like this anymore. Oh, no. Lens, lens is Hi, so my much name's better. Ed from Castleford. I've got a question for Craig. Craig, a few weeks ago. When that lift didn't work in Ed and Catchy's American Smooth, you said you would be willing to do it later on in the bar, maybe for charity. Have you forgotten? Or are you still up for it? <laughs> I had conveniently yes, forgotten. Yes, I will do it for charity yes. in the bar. <laughs> Show it on the show on Monday. This isn't live, is it, Charlie? This show. You can edit that bit out. Oh, that bit will be live. <laughs> um, I don't know. He loves Greg, really. Uh, it's so lovely to have you with us. Have an amazing weekend, Craig. Yeah!